Hi, in this video I will introduce the classification of subatomic particles into categories. The first category we will consider is hadrons. Hadron means bulky in Greek and this category includes all particles that are made of quarks including protons and neutrons. Hadrons can be affected by all fundamental forces including the strong nuclear force. Hadrons can be divided into two categories baryons and mesons. Baryon means heavy in Greek and includes particles with an odd number of quarks, usually three quarks. The most common ba baryons are protons and neutrons. Mesons, meaning intermediate in Greek, are particles made of one quark and one antiquark. Examples of mesons include pions and kions. More of those in a later video. All baryons have a baryon number of 1 and all mesons have a baryon number of 0. In any interaction baryon number must be conserved. The second category is leptons. Lepton means small in Greek and can be defined as particles that can interact by weak, gravitational and electromagnetic forces, but not by the strong force. Leptons are fundamental particles, they are not made of anything smaller. There are six types of leptons divided into three generations. Each generation includes two particles, one charged and one uncharged. In the first generation you'll find the electron and the electron neutrino. In the second and third generations you'll find the muon and the tau particles along with their respective neutrinos. Muons and tau particles are much heavier than electrons and they will rapidly decay to form electrons. Similar to baryon number, lepton number must also be conserved. However, each generation of lepton has its own lepton number which must be conserved separately. Thank you for watching this video from Cowan Physics. If you found it useful, please like, subscribe, and visit cowanphysics.com.